Nashville, Tennessee is my home. I wasn't born here, but I love it here. I've been here a long time. It's known around the world as the home of country music and maybe recorded music in general. But there's a dark underside to Nashville in this area that I've explored in writing against the shadows grain connections with Nashville and the shadow government, Nazis, Illuminati, ISIS, terrorists in general. It's a story not that many people know about. There's a lot of facts that are brought up in Against the Shadows Grain that if you'll explore for yourself, you'll find them very intriguing and very frightening. The story of Against the Shadows Grain begins with the discovery of an ancient Sumerian tablet. The police bring it to a university professor because he's one of the few people in the world capable of reading it and decoding the secrets that lie within the tablet. We have several dark organizations trying to form into one giant shadow government, so to speak, and they want the secrets that are within this tablet. So they kidnap the professor and interrogate him in order to learn what secrets this tablet holds and use it for their plan to take over the world. <laughs> Enough! Enough! Increase the amabarbital by 0.5% and raise the DMT by 5 grams per thousand. No. We are here to read the Sumerian text. You will tell us what we need to know. Tell them. It will be all right. All right. I'll read it to you. But just to see if you're smart enough to understand what you've just been told, Mr. Master Race. Our hero, Nikki, helps the professor escape, and she has inside information about the shadow organization because she used to be a member and defected. There is a Nazi agent coming today in Nashville. You arranged to meet him, correct? Uh, yeah, uh, Baron von Bloomberg, yes. Okay, you will assassinate him within 24 hours. Was it a long walk through the tunnel, sir? Yes, but it was safe. Two left and right, thank you, customers. Welcome to Monte Video. Thank you. Javo. We have a defector to deal with. I was looking for you. I have something very important for you. I, I'm not trying to defend. Wow. Do you know what this is? No. But I knew it was something special. So I brought it to you. It's not a gift, Seth. I hate this. People think I spy on them. I, I wish I could turn this off. Now, I've also been authorized to offer you a position on Mrs. Forbes' Psychic Advisory Intelligence Staff. Here's $50,000 cash. Now. Today. Jonah, yesterday the police discovered the body of Egon Longwater. I put another team on it right away, but they can come up with nothing. On 7th, 1942, the U.S. government seized all the money of the Union Banking Corporation, quote, as Nazi assets and convicted Prescott and his brother of aiding and abetting the enemy. Convicted. Sure, I can have it analyzed for you. I won't be intimidated by anyone, including you or your good squad. If you will remember, you already agreed to the terms of these arrangements and accepted payment. Found the tablet for me and I will found $100,000 bonus for each of you. There's a Nashville Nazi connection, all right. Tetra Ethel, then. Ethyl gas. Yeah. Originally it was an additive to aviation fuel. Like the German Messerschmitt and the Japanese Zero ran on ethyl gas. They had to have it. There were only two companies that held the patents. One of them was in Nashville. Really? Yeah. Well, they're international corporations, not American corporations. It was all legal. Your abilities is not in question. Well, just what if that's in question then? Well, that led us to researching Orichalcum, which is common in meteorites, but is very rare on Earth. 
We have been looking for them since the war. The clay tablet and the meteorite? Yes. An ancient Samarian key of life tablet. Yes, it's the key to the master race. How would you like to live for another hundred years or more? In perfect health? Yes. Only chosen few throughout the history have known the secret. Inca, Aztec, the Mayan priest, Jesus. We nearly deciphered it during the war, but they have been forced to move it to a safer location. I expect the results in four hours. They decide people at the top of the American government have to know what's going on with the, uh, the Nazi terrorist group. Not just Nazis, seven different organizations have combined terrorist groups here. And they decide they're going to expose them before the national media get a hold of the story and can spin it. Our story is filled with intrigue and mystery and is told against the backdrop of Nashville, Tennessee, a city known for its music, but has hidden talismans and secrets known to only a few. It's the chosen spot for this new world order. So it becomes a story of high tech versus low tech. There are psychic advisors who are good guys that switch sides. Uh, there are witches, we have terrorists, we have bikers, we have the political figures. Our story is rich with colorful characters, political intrigue, and a high stakes cat and mouse game. All twisted into one big story based on a lot of fact that happens in the Nashville area.